Hello, my guy. Today, you're going to learn the subtle physical cues a girl shows when she's attracted to you. Stick around and you might just pick up on signals you've been missing. Now let's get started. One, adjusting her bra strap. First up, let's talk about adjusting her bra strap. Now, this might seem like a minor thing, but it's often a sign she's feeling self-conscious or wants to look her best around you. Imagine you're having a conversation and she casually slides her finger under her strap to reposition it. If she does it while making eye contact or in a slightly noticeable way, there's a good chance she's feeling a spark of attraction. Why does this happen? Well, adjusting the bra strap can be a subconscious move to ensure everything is in place. It's a small gesture that can indicate she's aware of her appearance and wants to look good for you. Of course, sometimes it's just about comfort, but combined with other cues, it's a solid hint. Two, lightly scratching. Next, we've got the light scratch. If she's gently scratching her arm, neck, or leg with one or two fingers, it might signal nervousness or emotional arousal. Picture this, you're talking, and she's scratching her arm while leaning towards you and maintaining eye contact. This could mean she's into you. Why do women scratch lightly when they're attracted? Often it's a sign of heightened emotional state. Scratching can be a way to release nervous energy or signal that she's feeling something more. Everyone has their nervous tics, so look for this happening more around you than others. Three, tracing patterns on her skin. Here's an interesting one. If she's drawing shapes on her arm or thigh with her fingers, it could be a sign she's self-soothing due to nervous energy or attraction. Imagine her doing this while you're having a deep conversation. If it intensifies during your interaction, she's probably feeling some strong emotions. Why tracing patterns? This behavior often happens when someone is deep in thought or feeling a bit anxious. It's a way to calm oneself down. If she's doing this more when she's with you, it could be her way of managing the heightened emotions she feels in your presence. Four, pulling her hair back. Hair play is a big one. If she's slowly running her fingers through her hair or gathering it into a ponytail in a deliberate manner, she's likely trying to draw attention to her features. Picture her sweeping her hair to one side while maintaining eye contact. This isn't just practical. It's a powerful nonverbal cue of attraction. So why does this happen? Pulling hair back can be a way to showcase her neck and face, which are often considered attractive features. It's a way of saying, hey, look at me, without actually saying it. If she does this in a slow, deliberate manner, she's likely feeling attracted to you and wants to make sure you notice her. Five, soft moans or sighs. This one's subtle but telling. These sounds often occur when she's close to you, like during a hug or while dancing. They indicate contentment and emotional arousal. Picture a quiet moment where she lets out a soft sigh. This involuntary reaction shows she's comfortable and connected with you. So why the soft moans or sighs? These sounds are often a sign of relaxation and emotional release. If she feels safe and happy around you, these sounds might slip out unconsciously. They're a good sign that she's enjoying your company and feels at ease with you. Six, another interesting cue is flaring her fingers. When she spreads her fingers wide on a surface like a table or her thigh, it's a sign of heightened emotional arousal. Imagine her doing this while you're talking and maintaining strong eye contact. It shows she's engaged and potentially attracted to you. This gesture can indicate she's feeling excited or nervous. It's a physical release of pent up energy. If she does this more around you, it's likely because you make her feel something special. Seven, subtle arching of the back. The subtle back arch is a classic. If she's slightly arching her back to push her chest forward, she's drawing attention to her figure. Picture her doing this while standing or sitting, especially if it intensifies during your conversation or after a compliment. It's a sign she's trying to present herself attractively. So why arching the back? This posture highlights her curves and can be an unconscious way to appear more alluring. If she does this around you, she's likely trying to get your attention in a subtle yet effective way. Eight, standing on tiptoes. Standing on tiptoes is endearing. If she rises up on her toes in crowded places or to get closer to you, it's a sign she wants more intimacy. Imagine her doing this while maintaining eye contact or whispering something to you. It's a charming indication of attraction. Why tiptoes? Standing on tiptoes can make her feel closer to you, especially if there's a height difference. It's a way to bridge the physical gap and create a sense of closeness. If she does this often, it's a good sign she wants to be nearer to you. Nine, the lip wetting. If she's frequently using her tongue to moisten her lips in a subtle or sensual manner, she's likely feeling a strong sense of attraction. Picture her doing this while holding eye contact with you. It's a potent signal that she's interested and subconsciously drawing attention to her mouth. This can be a sign of nervousness or anticipation. Wetting the lips can make them appear more inviting and is often an unconscious move when someone is feeling attracted. 
If she's doing this a lot around you, it's a strong sign she's into you. 10. Mirroring your movements. If she's subtly copying your gestures, posture, or expressions, it's a strong sign of attraction. For example, if you lean forward, she might do the same shortly after. This subconscious mimicry shows she's trying to create a connection with you. So why does this happen? Mirroring is a way to build rapport and show empathy. It's an unconscious effort to synchronize with the person she's interested in. If you notice her doing this often, she's likely very interested in you. 11. Playing with objects. Another telltale sign is if she's playing with objects like her jewelry, a pen, or her phone. This can indicate nervous energy or an attempt to draw attention to her hands and face. Imagine her twirling a ring or tapping a pen while talking to you. It's a subtle way of expressing interest and keeping your attention focused on her. This behavior can be a sign of anxiety or excitement, common emotions when someone is attracted to another person. It's a way to channel nervous energy and can be a good indicator that she's feeling something strong around you. 12. Frequent eye blinking. Here's another subtle sign. If you notice her blinking more often than usual when she's around you, it could be a sign of attraction. Blinking is an involuntary response that can increase when someone is feeling nervous or excited. Increased blinking can be a reaction to heightened emotional arousal. It's a subconscious way of managing the feelings of excitement and nervousness that come with attraction. If she's blinking a lot more than usual, especially when making eye contact with you, it's a good sign she's interested. 13. Open body language. If she's positioning herself in an open, welcoming manner, such as uncrossed arms, legs pointing towards you, or maintaining a relaxed posture, it's a strong indication of attraction. Imagine her sitting with her body facing you directly, arms open, and leaning slightly forward. This open body language shows she's comfortable and engaged. So why open body language? When someone is attracted to another person, they often subconsciously adopt open body language to signal their availability and interest. It's a way of creating an inviting atmosphere and showing that she's receptive to your presence. If she's displaying open body language around you, it's a clear sign she's into you. 14. Finally, let's talk about touching her neck or collarbone. This area is sensitive and often highlighted when someone is feeling vulnerable or trying to draw attention to their femininity. Imagine her lightly grazing her fingers over her neck or adjusting her necklace while talking to you. This subtle touch can be a sign of nervousness or a subconscious effort to attract your attention. Why does this happen? The neck and collarbone are delicate areas and touching them can be a way to soothe anxiety or subtly highlight her femininity. It's a combination of self-comfort and flirtation. If she does this frequently around you, she's likely feeling a mix of nervous excitement and attraction. So there you have it, 14 subtle physical cues women display when they're attracted to you. Start paying attention to these signs and you might just discover someone's been into you all along. If you found this video helpful, give it a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to After School Psychology for more psychology-related dating videos. See you next time.